Hello and welcome back everyone. And Wolf here with even more Star Wars The Old Republic. Playing as Kyphus Kane here, my Jedi Knight, here on the world of Quesh. Where we last left off, we were breaking the majority of the Hood Cartel's droid army as they were assaulting some of the adrenal processing factories. We're now going to go on the offensive once again by trying to capture the Imperial commander of this world, Moff Grayson, who has holed himself up within the palace of Broga the Hot, one of the leaders of the three families, probably the only leader remaining after the other two were likely executed earlier on in the Imperial agent storyline. Broga should also be dead, but will um allow that part of the storyline to kind of um peek by, <laughs> I suppose. Yeah, in the Imperial storyline you kill all three members. Or you have the opportunity to kill all three, I suppose. You could spare one if you so chose. But Ah, uh, the palace of Broga the Hot. We have chosen not to go through the way of valor and fight our way through the front lines to the palace entrance. We are going to go through a side entrance filled with traps, according to Broga the Hot himself. We do actually have a codex entry on Moff Drayson himself. Moff Drayson is both a canny commander and a meticulous student of the art of war. Although confident of an eventual imperial victory, he has been careful to win over elements within the three families and recruit Republic defectors, knowing the Empire's foothold on Quesh is not yet cemented. His most notable achievement on Quesh is the capture of Broga the Hutt's palace, a key defensive position he has since adopted as his fallback headquarters and private residence, after some refurbishing. It is Moff Drayson's private hope that a victory on Quesh will not only begin the Republic's inevitable fall, but, ha but ha perhaps see him installed as a governor of one of the galaxy's most profitable worlds. So despite its toxic atmosphere, Moff Drayson sees this world as being extremely valuable to whichever side comes out victorious. Couldn't you handle this yourself? Umpa hupa, chikilia umpasa do biska. Organonua, utatiacha nichu, kuya maya stupa. What are the Imperials doing that's so bad? How exactly can I help with this? Malituta Udmishka Uchusa Yomata Chitoya Nankanoya Choski Nawi Okay, so this Jedi is against the Imperial methods of quickly extracting Quesh Venom. wants us to destroy the venom tanks 
that the Imperials have stored. Which is probably going to give a greater opportunity for the venom to evaporate, making the atmosphere even more toxic. But what do I know? I mean, it's already been collected. Why don't we just take the venom and hand it over to the Republic? There's those tanks that we need to uh, destroy. Fine. Yeah, it's asking us to destroy these venom tanks, but as I say, it's already too late. The venom's been collected, the method's already been used. We're just wasting raw venom. But no matter. Yeah, the Republic troops are very bravely gonna assault the palace head on. Whereas we are gonna make use of this side entrance. So, we need to be aware of any traps down here. It looks like we don't want to be setting off any alarm droids either. There, good as new. alarm droids we may have they may have got a signal off that we're coming
really seeing too many of these traps that we were warned of, apart from the numerous droids of course. That does not look good for your posture, Kira. But... Oh dear. Fun with that. One hell of a battle here. Well, men. The front entrance is secured, Master Jedi. My squad took a beating. We lost some good men, but we're ready to fight. There's bound to be trouble up ahead. No need for alarm, Captain. Just follow me, and we'll be fine. You heard the order, men. Move out! Welcome. I would offer you some of these excellent adrenals, but my warriors have used the last of them. Surrender, Moff Drayson. I'll see to it that you aren't harmed. I hope you realize what an honor you have been given today. You will play a pivotal role in galactic history. Your deaths will be the final outrage that forces the Republic's hand. And now I think it is time to conclude this. <laughs> <sighs> Come on, put the lightsaber away. Do you think you've won? The Republic's hold on Quesh is at an end. I had no idea Jedi were so gullible. 
all of this has only been a diversion. You never had the strength or the courage to strike the Empire down. And you never will. Captain, restrain this man and escort him to the Republic base. Gladly. You should go on ahead. General Corvan will meet you at the war camp to hear your report in person. Okay. Just a moment. Um... You have a bit of a problem and you're trying to solve it. There we go. Yeah, Moff Drayson was also trying to provoke the Republic in declaring war. Oh, the Imperials had some uh, adrenals here. I didn't actually see them. I thought we were going to have some witty line about how we didn't need to take the adrenals. We'd had some of our own before walking through the door. I see. Well, back to the war camp. Kira, you probably should inoculate yourself again. We've been here a while. The tanks are destroyed. Victory na 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 tuta. Da aita wanawanga na chuba. I wanawanga blasto chi. No, they'll probably just increase their venom extraction causing more fissures in the earth but what was Moff Drayson saying about the Republic's time on crashes at an end that our assault and his capture were but a diversion. Oh, we have Sif in here, past Republic lines. Chonki Fakota, Chihopoda, Chioto Vokise. My word. I expected trouble when I lost contact with Broga and Major Trig, but I never imagined this. Ono Nachatu, Nitutu Boga. Greetings, General. Lord Magrus. I suppose it was only a matter of time before the Sith became involved in this war. And you must be the little Jedi who's been helping them. Aren't you just precious? Is this really the best you could find, Corvan? Then are my deepest condolences. Tell us what you've done with Broga and Trig. It is with great sorrow that I must inform you of the defection of your valued servant and war hero, Major Trig. You are standing in the midst of his handiwork. He killed his own soldiers to deliver Broga to me. Chawa aite ya chachopa. The hut is with me in your former venom mine. Another gift from Major Trieg. I'm sure you aren't giving us this information for our benefit. I am issuing an invitation. 
Would you like these things back? Come to the mine and take them. My door is always open. This is my fault. I should have seen it coming. You think that Sith was telling the truth? Tree could be a prisoner too. That would make the situation no less dire. As it stands, Quesh is lost. There's little time to regain control before Republic Command orders us off the planet. We must stop Lord Magrus. And if the Major has turned against us, bring him to justice. Might as well send everyone we've got. There's nothing left to defend anyway. I can't send men to capture their own commanding officer. If word gets out, it would cause chaos in the ranks. All our hopes rest on you now. Find Lord Magrus and Major Trigg. Put a stop to this. Save Broga if you can. I'll return to base to await your report. Good luck. Then we don't tell them we're going after Major Trigg and that he defected. Just send the troops in to secure the entrance while we go deeper in. Say it's a rescue mission and Major Trigg was captured. No. No, I'm talking to myself again. He's already buggered off. Ah. Oh, well. What we'll do is once again take a small break here. And when we come back, this Lord Magrus has issued us an invitation. Yeah, down to the Grancha Lackland Venom Mine. Lovely! Ah, okay. <laughs> Thank you all for joining me once again with even more Star Wars The Old Republic. As always, feel free to leave a comment if you so wish. And hopefully I'll see you for even more next time. Until then, no, take care. Bye-bye now.